Hello all, welcome to Random Art with Karen and it's Craft Galley Card Day. I'm using the same two stamp sets that I've used for the last four videos, I believe. <laughs> Pink Fresh Studio, Fleur 2, and Paper Smooches Faith Sampler. I'm going to start by die cutting. So let me move this so you can see the dies that I'll be using today. So I'm going to take these and I'm going to run them through my die cutting machine and then I will be right back. Alright, so we have our dies ready for our card. It's beautiful yellow. Yellow is a happy color. Happy color. And again, I use dies because... Uh, I know I'll get uh, symmetry, and this lovely stitching gives another little extra uh, added uh, fun and dimension to your card. I think yellow and gray is a pretty color combination. And here we're going to have a little template. All right. So I'm going to start out with these two pieces here. I want to secure this with some washi tape because I don't want it to move on me. And then I'm going to try to sort of kind of center my template here. And then I'm going to secure it with some washi tape. I'm going to take this yellow ink pad and just take the pad itself and I'm going to hold on to that and just go across like that and you want to start not on the cardstock but away here at the edge as you're pulling through now I use cat hair you don't have to if you want to <laughs> my gosh all right now I'm coming from the other side and again, I'm just bringing that across. I love my kitties. <laughs> All right, so that's what we have created. All right, let me get my Pink Fresh Studio Fleur stamp. And I'm going to use uh, gray. I just love the softness of gray. And... Again, I think this yellow and gray is a pretty color combination. And then I love, too, how these stamps can kind of just curve around your sentiment. Uh, just kind of move it around, make, make sure. Yes, beautiful, beautiful. Now this is from the Paper Smooches Faith Sampler. Going straight down, straight back up. And I like this Faith Sampler. It has so many words that you can create uh, your own saying. And again, if you've seen my other videos, you've seen how I've mixed and matched those. Straight down and straight back up. I think Easter's coming in April, sometime in April. So this would make a lovely Easter card. I did use this little glitter pen that I have, a, a spica. Uh, if you have a glitter pen or maybe uh, stickles, something like that, I wanted just to bring just a little bit of glitz into these leaves and a little shimmer and shine. So I'm just going in there and coloring a little bit. Again, as you notice, most of my cards are quick and easy and I've been privileged to be published in uh, Take 10 magazine from Stamping 10 and Company and the reason it's called Take 10 is because there are cards that you can make in about 10 minutes. <laughs> yeah I was privileged uh, to be one of their uh, guest designers. Uh, this is no longer in publication. I I think you might be able to get it in digital format uh, from Stampington and Company, but lots of ideas if you really need to get a lot of things done uh, quickly. All right, so let me get my adhesive. I've added my little glitz there. 
I'm using the white liner adhesive. In one of my videos, I think I showed you how to do two cards. So uh, I hope you're getting a lot of ideas uh, from my videos. And then I also use my stamps uh, in my planner if you happen to be a planner person. And uh, also Bible art. I'm not sure if you're familiar with Bible art. Uh, then I also do um, uh, faith journaling where I write down my daily devotionals. And I love to use my stamps in that too. Let's see, I'm trying to decide. You know how I love my little adhesive squares. So I want to use my adhesive. I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna pull this together and then make then I'll make my decision. I have to pull it out and look at it. And uh, and then I'll decide. Do I use one of my little foam squares? Because I'm thinking about maybe adding some twine or something like that. Again, when I'm pulling off this excess, I'm just tacking it onto the side of my table here uh, so I can use it on my next project. So the beauty of those rolls is you don't waste you don't waste any of your tape. Oop, got a little bend there. All right. So yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and do this. And uh, I don't know about you, but I um, make my cards to open like this. Um, one of the reasons is, it, you know, if people want to put them out for a while for display, especially maybe if they're it's a get well card and they're in the hospital, uh, then it then it ends up standing up real nice, uh, so they can see it. Yeah, I'm kind of digging this twine. It's got a little gold. So yeah. Yep, we're going to tie this around, and then I'm going to be using my little foam squares. I think I'll go a couple of times. I think I'm going to tie it back here. Please tell me I brought my scissors over here. <laughs> Just when you think you have everything together, and then you go to take your video, and you're like, oh, shoot. What did I do with that? Did I not bring that? We're fixing to find out. And the answer is, oh, it's back here. Okay. We're good. We're good. A little snip. Okay. I think. I don't want to manipulate this. I don't know. I may keep it like at an angle like that. That's kind of cool. Kind of cool. Especially since I just tore that up. Pull that apart. Let's get you back where you need to be. Get you back where you need to be. Okay. And get my adhesive dots. My little square. Foam squares. Yeah, these are available uh, at the Craft Galley shop. Yeah, they have everything you need. They've got your adhesives. Of course, they've got tons of stamps. Um, Altenew, Lawn Fawn, Pink Fresh Studio, Studio Katya, Hero Arts, Newton's Nook. Um, there I go again, trying to remember. and not doing a very good job of it. <laughs> All right, let's get this little card adhered here. All right. All right. So there you go, good people. Do you like that? I hope you do. Uh, again, this was just so quick and easy. Did what about, I don't even have a look at my time. I know it's been about 10 minutes. Again, die cuts are going to be your BFF. Uh, quick and simple, but yet it looks like I took time because they have all these beautiful layers. Check the descriptor box below. Make sure you check out Craft Galley. Find all of the wonderful stamp sets and other accessories that they have available for us stampers. Join our Facebook group. Follow the blog because we got some great designers out there. I appreciate y'all checking with me today. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. 
please consider subscribing to the channel if you're not a subscriber already. Let's do the wave. Bye. Look forward to card making with you next Tuesday.